Hi everyone and welcome to my channel Aussie Travel Gal. I am coming to you to talk to you about my review of my cruises. So this was a cruise package that we booked for October 2023 and we booked through my cruises. It was a 28 night package and I did do a video for you giving you a review of my cruises up until before we were due to go, which is here. So if you want to just click on that and, and have a look at that video, go for it. But now that we're back, we have been back for a couple of months now, and it's time that I actually provide you with a review on how it actually went and how I rated my cruises through the process. Okay, so first things first. So this is just a recap. This was a 28 night cruise package. It was a flight from Sydney to London, two nights accommodation in London, a cruise on MSC Virtuosa from London or Southampton to Dubai, and then a flight home from Dubai to Sydney. Now for all that package was $4,990, an absolute steal. Now we did upgrade, we upgraded to a balcony. Now on MSC they have experiences. So they have a Bella experience, which is your standard. So there's no perks as such, it's just standard. And then they have Fantastica, which provides a few little perks, but I'm not sure exactly what they were. And we were with Aria. So we were Aria experience and we booked a balcony. Now with Aria, we were provided with a thermal spa. So we could go to their thermal spa for the whole cruise at any time. We also got access to their top deck solarium, which was amazing. Have a look at this. So this was when we were going through the Suez Canal and we basically spent the whole, nearly the whole day in the jacuzzi sipping cocktails while we had that view of the Suez Canal, amazing. So, and we also had anytime dining. So majority had the set timing from about 5.45 through I think to 9.45. And that was the time that they had to go every night where our experience was it was anytime dining. So we could basically just walk into the rest, restaurant at any time and be, be able to sit down. It was great. So all this was 2,300 per person. And I wasn't exactly sure whether I thought that was worth it, but we were very happy with some of the perks. We also upgraded to a drinks package for the whole time that we were on that cruise, so 26 nights. And that was an alcohol drinks package and that was $1,000 for the 26 nights. That's $39 per day and their cocktails were $18 a cocktail. So, and I'm talking Australian. So. Um, that was two cocktails and we had that covered. So we drank way more than $1,000 over the 26 nights. So that made up for it. That was just superb. So the package itself that was advertised through my cruises was amazing value and it definitely recommend it. So two weeks prior to the sailing, we received an email from my cruises with all the information we needed with the flight itineraries, the cruise tickets the and all the check-in information, um, the hotel accommodation information, and then also the bus transfer from the hotel to the cruise terminal. So the only thing that we really had to do was organise to get ourselves to the airport, from the airport to the hotel, and then from the cruise ship to the airport. Other than that, they had everything taken care of. We didn't have to communicate with them at all while we were away. Everything went smoothly. We got to the hotel. The flights were fine. The flights were on Emirates. That was amazing. I hadn't been on Emirates before, so I was very happy with Emirates. The service was great. The flight was perfect. Um, we got to the hotel about 10 a.m., so we were expecting to just dump our, dump our suitcases and then just stroll for a while because the room wouldn't be ready. However, the room they had a room ready for us, so we were able to go into our room at 10 a.m., which was great. The, the hotel itself, this was the hotel. It was Blue Radisson and it was the location was amazing. It was basically near the Strand, so just a short stroll to where all the theatre shows were. Um, yeah, we were very happy with it. The, the hotel itself, I think, was four stars and it was clean, it was tidy, it was, it was beautiful. So... We had a Facebook group that was arranged 
for uh, this particular cruise and I think there were like 2,000 people that were on this Facebook group. So obviously there were a whole heap of, of people that would book through my cruises that were on this Facebook group as well as other people that were just on the cruise itself. So a lot of people from the UK were on it and it was great to interact and engage and get excited for the lead up with these group of fellow cruisers that we were going to catch up with on board. So the first night at the hotel, there were quite there was quite a few of us that were staying at this hotel through my cruises. So we decided to organize an event. So we had an event on the first night where we all a group of us, there was about 30 of us that that decided to meet at the bar at the hotel and just have drinks. And it was that was so good because we felt like we were great friends before we jumped on the cruise ship. So definitely recommend whenever you've got a cruise book, make sure you look up to make see if they've got a Facebook group page because the Facebook group page would be the name of the ship. So ours was MSC Virtuosa. And then it would be the date, the sail date of the cruise. So in our case, it was 27th of October, 2023. Um, if you do that, you should be able to find the group. But it's great to communicate with your fellow cruisers before jumping on. And also there's events and, and that sort of thing that's organised throughout the cruise through these Facebook groups. So definitely recommend it. Okay, so embarkation day. So the morning of, we had to all meet at the lobby in the hotel around 9 a.m. to 9.30, a little bit staggered because there was quite a few of us and there were three buses organised to take us to the cruise terminal. So we only had to wait about 15 minutes, jumped on the bus and it was about an hour and a half from the hotel to the cruise terminal. We jumped off the bus. Um, it was raining at the time, which was a little bit of a pain, but that was fine. We had an umbrella. We took, got our suitcases, MSC crew took our suitcases and we went through the check-in process, which was so easy. Went through the security. Again, there was not a lot of people there. There was no lineups at all. And we were on board with a cocktail in hand within 40 minutes. So that whole check-in process for the cruise itself was amazing probably the best that I've ever experienced for such a huge cruise ship because this cruise ship there was uh, I think four and a half thousand on this cruise so um, the, yeah the process was amazing so how do I rate my cruises as a cruise company I'm giving them nine out of ten and I'm dropping them one only because the when we were organizing the flights we couldn't actually speak to someone. It was all through email back and forth. And the that that little that process was a bit daunting for me because I really wanted to speak to someone. But in saying that they were very responsive and they would provide us with a list of the flights to and a list of the flights back. Um, and we got to choose what suited us. So for instance, when we flew from Dubai to Sydney, we chose there was a list of about five different flights that we could choose and we chose a 9 p.m. one so that way we could have the whole day in Dubai to have a look around before heading to the airport. So yes, 9 out of 10 my cruisers, they are fantastic. They took care of every, everything for us, never had an issue and they were always so responsive when we needed to contact them to talk to them about anything. So we will be looking and booking another cruise package which we just love the cruise packages and the deals that they provide. So we will definitely be booking another one through my cruises. So I hope this has helped. And anyone that has been like looking at a cruise package through my cruises and just not sure what they are like, I definitely recommend them. So if you find a great cruise package deal, jump on it and you will have the best time we did. So if you like my video, please give it a like. And if you're wanting to know more about the content that I provide to you on cruises, tips, etc. Hit the subscribe button and I can't wait to show you my next video.